hello everyone so let us discuss this problem here so if v1 v2 and v3 this set is a basis of r3 then we have to show that v1 comma v1 plus v2 comma v1 minus v2 these three vector are forming this set and this is also a basis of r3 so to show something is a basis of r3 or basis of any vector space we have to show that that set is linearly independent and it also spans the whole vector space so at first check for the linearly independent so if a v1 plus b v1 plus v2 now this is my second vector v1 plus v2 and my third vector is v1 minus v3 v1 minus v3 this thing is zero in r3 because we are uh, inside this vector space r3 then uh, to show that these three are linearly independent we have to show this a b c are zero so let us write so this is a v1 plus b v1 plus b v2 plus c v1 minus c v3 this is zero now if we take all the v1s together that is a plus b plus c v1 plus b v2 plus sorry minus this is minus minus c v3 so this is zero now as v1 v2 v3 are already a basis of this vector space so this v1 v2 v3 are linearly independent so what we get we are getting a plus b plus c is zero b is zero and minus c is zero which eventually implies c is zero so as b and c are zero from the first equation we get a is also zero so all these three scalars a b c are zero so clearly the given set suppose i am writing this set as s so s is linearly independent now we have to show that our s will span r3 so we already know that v1 v2 and v3 span r3 so let me write it here so span of v1 v2 and v3 is r3 and we want to show so to show span of s is also r3 so let us take any vectors from r3 so let v belongs to r3 now what i can do so i can write this v as a linear combination of v1 v2 and v3 as that span r3 that you already know so i can write v equal to a v1 plus b v2 plus c v3 for some scalars a b and c for some a b c belongs to r now let me rewrite this as follows so i can write it a minus b plus c of v1 plus b so this is b v1 plus v2 minus c v1 minus v3 so i can rewrite this same v uh, that is a v1 plus b v2 plus c v3 like this so if you calculate this then you will see that this is same as the above equation so you can see that i can write v in as a linear combination of v1 v1 plus v2 and v1 minus v3 which we are intended to do so here our scalars are a minus b plus c v, uh, b and minus c so these three are the scalars uh, and so i can write any vectors in r3 as a linear combination of set of vectors from s so what we intended to show we have already shown it so span of s is nothing but r3 so clearly s is a basis of r3 thank you